Michael Jackson welcomed thousands of children to his home, often without their parents present. And within five years, he was the subject of allegations of abuse that would follow him for the rest of his life. The star vehemently denied abusing teenager Geordie Chandler and the case was settled out of court when the family accepted an £18 million settlement. One friend of Jackson's says the star was innocent of this first allegation of abuse made against him because he couldn't help but tell him the truth. In a darkened studio, he suddenly tells me, asks me, Ori, you know, there's this, this food that I, I, you know, I crave for. Uh, can you stop me from eating it? It was very lighthearted. And I said to him, well, I was a hypnotist in Israel. Will you allow me to hypnotize you? And he says, wow, can you really do it? And I said, okay. And then I hypnotized him very deeply. I put him into a very deep trance. And then I did something highly unethical, which I admit today. While he was under trance, I suddenly asked him, and these were the words, Michael, did you ever touch a child in an inappropriate manner? And Michael Jackson immediately answered back and he says, no, I would never do that. And then I asked him immediately, why did you pay Jody Chandler off millions of dollars? And he answered immediately, I couldn't take it anymore. I had enough. So to me, this was a personal validation that this man is innocent. <laughs> <laughs>